Okay, let's go over the variables. Um, dependent variable, independent variable, constants. If you were going to do a lab with, and you had three plants, so you have a plant here, there, and there, and you're going to give this one red light, and you're going to give this one blue light, and you're going to give this one green light, and you want to see which plant is going to grow the tallest with that colored light. Okay, so what you're changing is going to be the independent variable. So the independent variable for this one is going to be the color of light because that's what you're changing. And then the dependent variable is the one that you're measuring at the end to see if the independent variable affected the experiment. So the dependent variable for this one is going to be plant height. And then a constant is something that you don't change. So constant could be like the um, amount of water because you, you would give them all the same amount of water because you only change one thing in the experiment. A constant could also be the size of the pot that the plant is in. It could be the soil. You give them all the same kind of soil. And then you would also, if you do an experiment, if you're testing something, you also want a control group. The control group would be over here. It's something that you're not experimenting with, so it's going to receive the same kind of constants, but as far as the light, it's just going to receive regular sunlight. That way you know how your experiment works, because if one of these grew better with, say, blue light, then um, you wouldn't know if it was because it was blue light or if it would have just worked better with sunlight. So you need to have your control group. So the independent variable is the one that you're changing. The dependent variable is the one that you measure at the end. And the constant are the ones that stay the same. And then you have your control group, which is your group that you're not even experimenting with.